Andy Katz here for the Big Ten Network with a reaction to the 2022-23 Gavit games between the Big Ten and the Big East. Here are my top five. There are eight games, top five of the eight for the Big Ten. Eight teams playing from the Big Ten in this event. Number one, Indiana at Xavier. The Hoosier schedule continues to be outstanding in the non-conference. My pick to win the Big Ten. Going to Xavier, taking on new head coach, Sean Miller. This could be a huge pickup in terms of non-conference win. Remember, Ohio State had to go to Xavier in this event. Not an easy place to play at the Cintas Center. It'll be rocking for the Hoosiers coming into Xavier. Number two, Villanova under new head coach, Kyle Neptune, going to Michigan State. Another potential quality win for the Spartans at home if they can get it against a team that I think will finish somewhere in that top three of the Big East. Number three, Sneaky good game here. Chris Murray and Iowa going to Seton Hall. I always had some great games in the state of New Jersey at Rutgers. Now they have to go to Newark to take on Seton Hall. Shaheen Holloway, the new head coach of Seton Hall, I think it's a quality potential road win for Iowa. Number four, Butler at Penn State. Penn State could be sneaky good next season in the Big Ten. Thad Mata taking in the Butler Bulldogs will not be an easy task. For Micah Shrewsbury, who knows Butler all too well, taking on Butler at Penn State. And number five, Marquette at Purdue. This should be a really good game. Two teams that are reshuffling a little bit, but I think Purdue's going to be really good by the end of the year. It's going to be a quality non-conference game for the Boilermakers at Mackey Arena. So those are my top five gambit games between the Big Ten and the Big East next season.